morning, I'd like to talk to you about some ideas, concepts, philosophies, tools that can help you prepare for excellence even when you're already very successful. They're plain, simple, common sense ideas. And please remember, they happen to work for me. If one or two happen to work for you, you can use it in your business, your life, your family. Terrific. I like to call that take home value. So idea number one, people don't care how much you know about them once they realize how much you care about them. When I was 21 years old, I developed a 66 question customer profile that we require all of our salespeople to fill out. You wouldn't believe how much we know about our customers. The IRS wouldn't believe how much we know about our customers. And I'm not talking about their taste in envelopes either. We want to know based on routine conversation and observation what a customer is like as a human being, what he or she feels strongly about, what he's most proud of having achieved, any status symbols in his or her offices. In other words, we want to know what turns that customer slash client on. All right, let me explain the case 66 a little more in depth, if I may. And remember, this is very critical also. This is not just for our customers. This is for our suppliers. I want the best cart manufacturers in the country. I want the best paper makers in the country. I want the best ink suppliers. Anyone who walks through our front door, we want to build a long-term relationship. No difference between customers and suppliers. Here are some specific questions we ask among the 66 questions. We want to know about their education. We want to know about their family and marital status. Does the customer exercise, as Joy was talking about a few moments ago? We want to know about their medical history, current condition of health. Does the customer drink? Does the customer smoke? Hobbies, vacation habits. Question number 66 on the form. Does your competitor have more and better answers to the above questions than you do? Now this is a concept philosophy tool. It doesn't answer all the questions, but dramatically increases the probability you will get the business over a long period of time. People buy from other people because of likability, because of chemistry, because of people skills. And yes, you have to perform. If you don't perform, throw the 66 folder and file just out the window. You must perform. Build the relationship also. No one's going to take that business away from you. I call it humanize. Humanize your selling strategy. You cannot, under any set of circumstances, know enough about your customers, employees, suppliers, competitors, 